Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to solve these five tricky SAT math problems. The first question is this one. The two semicircles in this figure have center A and B. If AB is equal to 12, what is the total length of this curve? Let this is R1 and this is R2 and R1 plus R2 is equal to 12. We know that the circumference for half circle is equal to pi r. Let this is c1 and this curve is c2. So the total length will be equal to c1 plus c2 and that will be equal to pi r1 plus pi r2. By taking pi common, we can write r1 plus r2 and r1 plus r2 is 12. So this is 12 pi and this is the correct answer. The second question is this one. If A is an odd integer and B is an even integer, which of the following is an odd integer? Let A is 1 and B is 2. Just put this in all the options. So this will be 6, this will be 1 plus 3, 4 and this will be 2 into 1 plus 2 and 2 into 3, 6. This will be 1 plus 2 into 2 and this is 5 and this is 2a plus b. So 2 into 1 plus 2, this is 4. So just this is odd integer. So this is the correct option. The third question is this one. If 10 plus x is 5 more than 10, what is the value of 2x? This is means equal. And 5 more than 10 is 5 plus 10. So the question is now very simple. We will write 10 plus x is equal to 5 plus 10. 10 is cancelled from both the sides or subtracted from both the sides. So x is equal to 5 and 2x is 10. So this is the correct option. This is the fourth question. Ali, Ben and Carla made a total of 20 sandwiches. Ben made three times as Ali. Carla made twice as Ben. How many sandwiches did Ali make? Let Ali's sandwiches are X. So Ben made three times as Ali. So Ben's sandwiches are 3X. Then Carla made Twice is Ben, so Carla's sandwiches are 2 into 3x. Twice is Ben, so 2 into 3x. This is 6x. Now the total sandwiches are 20. So x plus 3x plus 6x is equal to 20. Add this and we get 10x is equal to 20. Dividing both sides by 10 and we get x is equal to 2. So x is Ali's sandwiches. So the correct option is A. The fifth question is this one. Alma bought a laptop computer at a store that gave 20% discount of its original price. The total amount she paid to the cashier was P dollars, including an 8% sale tax on the discounted price. Which of the following represents the original price of the computer in terms of P? So the, let the original price, the original price is X. Then there is discount 20%. So the discounted price, there is 20% discount. So the discounted price will be 80%. And this is equal to 0.8x, 80% of x. This is equal to 0.8x. Now the total amount she paid to the cashier. So the paid amount is P. And P also included 8% sale tax. So P is equal to this 80% of the original price plus 
एट परसेंट सेल टैक्स सो एट परसेंट सेल टैक्स ऑन दिस प्राइस बाय टेकिंग पॉइंट एट एक्स कॉमन फ्रॉम दिस we get 1 plus 8 percent and 8 percent is 0.08 so this is equal to 0.8 x into 1.08 we can write it like this x into 0.8 into 1.08 dividing these two both sides we can get x is equal to this and this is the right answer